What's up, everybody? Thank you for tuning to the channel. It's Stone Man Laura, and I appreciate you watching. Hope you're having a good day or night. I hope you had a good Christmas. This is the today's the 27th. Just got off of work, and I have a very cool review to do for you guys today. My cousin actually got me this Darth Malgus statue from Gentle Giant. He scored it for 60 bucks. Back of the box, the top. So I'm very excited to get into this. I'm gonna do a little unboxing today. Getting up into it. Hope you all had a good good Christmas. Hope you got some Black Series figures or some Star Wars shit. That's always cool. There's a little card up here on the top. A little card right there. Now this on it. See what that's about the letter. All right, let's crack this thing open. This is actually like my, uh, I guess technically my third, uh, my third Star Wars statue because I was also gifted two Unleashed Line seven inch statues of Boba Fett and Vader from 2005 and 2006. So I was pretty excited to get those. And I don't really have many statues. So I am super stoked to get this guy out and check it out and maybe get him next to Boba or Vader himself. And I never played the, uh, the Old Republic games, unfortunately. But when I seen Malice come out in the Black Series, I just had to get them because it was just a cool looking figure. It didn't really matter to me whether I had any personal connection to the character whatsoever. To me, it was just a badass, like, huge Sith Lord, so I wanted them. But I had seen all the cutscenes, and they're badass. It's literally like a, you're watching a whole movie. So I know this is taking me a minute to get this thing. I'm just trying to be very careful. I don't know. It's my work knife too, I need to sharpen this thing. So, okay, so the little bag is General Giant Certificate of Authenticity. So that's pretty cool. Okay. So that's kind of cool. Here's the front of the card there. Okay, let me actually, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna give you all a close up of the statue when I get it out. But I just did want to do an unboxing of it. Here's the card, certificate of authenticity. So that's pretty cool. Now for what y'all have tuned in to see. Now I can get to it with that card out the way. Snug. Pull this up. I think it's breaking out, so. You may want to fast forward through this part. Alright. So I'm pulling it out here from the back. Sitting like this. Sitting in there. These broke into pieces. Well, that fucking sucks. Oh man, that really blows. Wow, that um. That sucks. I mean, he's missing his whole leg now. Damn, dude. Lightsaber's broken in half. Dude, he just like, I was being so careful that he just fucking fell out. Damn, dude. Here's a whole piece of his feet, his whole leg. Here's his saber. Damn. That really sucks. There's our leg. Yeah, 
Damn, dude. I could probably try to glue it. Damn. That's a that's that's really a bummer. Cause my cousin got this for me and he was very excited to see it. So this thing is in absolute pieces. This is a piece of the cape. Goes on there, another piece of the cape. Lightsaber, his whole fucking leg. I mean, like he do, he barely slipped out. I'm, I'm very, I'm very bummed. And now my wife is helping me glue this motherfucker back together now. So, always appreciative for her. So I dropped this whole thing and it broke the leg off a piece of the cape and the lightsaber hilt, the end of the lightsaber hilt. And luckily my wife just got home and I showed her what happened and she could tell I was bummed out. So she got, uh, she found some Gorilla Glue and she helped me get this thing back together. And you can kind of tell it broke off there right at the cape, but the hand, the saber went back onto his hand perfectly. The knee, you can't really tell, was split. So really the only, one place you can really tell it, it was broken was the cape, but you kind of see the, the chipping right there and this line on the side. So I'm I'm extremely bummed out that I dropped this fucking thing, but you know, shit happens. That's what happened. Luckily I have a amazing wife and she cares a lot about my passions and Star Wars is one of my huge passions. So she walked in the door and seen it like this and she went to work on it right away to help me get it right. But now that it's out of the box, uh, I can do a proper review of it now. And I can honestly say it's it's very badass. I'm very happy to have it. Uh, the cape looks cool, the flowy kind of, uh, the flowy kind of settled look. The paint looks good. The eyes are a little too red for my liking. I would have liked to have seen a little bit more yellow. He looks kind of zombie looking. And the sculpt of the head is a little weird. It almost looks like, like it's it's very lined, like almost like toilet paper. But I, I know he was, uh, later on in his Sith career, he was aged very much and the dark side had kind of, deteriorated parts of his body and stuff like that but his armor looks accurate his cape is awesome uh the gauntlets on his uh on his arms look good they're very cleanly painted a little bit shinier than i thought it would be out of the box but the stand is really heavy and nice and uh i love it man it looks awesome i'm very happy to have it i'm glad that my wife showed up in town and we could get it back together so Again, I'm really bummed out about that, but like I said, shit happens. It is what it is. We we fix it the best of our ability and probably find a cool place to set it up where you can't really see that little line coming down through and the glue peeking out. But to the naked, you know, the naked eye, if you just kind of glance at it, you really can't see it. But obviously, once you start getting a closer look at it and checking it out, it it's pretty notice noticeable. So I am bummed out about that, but. Still looks awesome. I'm very happy to have it. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much that wraps it up for this review, y'all. I appreciate y'all watching and kind of kind of a butchered half-assed review, but nonetheless, I'm still happy to have it. Still very cool. Darth Malgus is badass. Uh, I'm gonna find somewhere for him to go with the collection on the shelf. So very happy. If you enjoyed this review, leave a like. I'd much appreciate it. Consider subscribing do a lot of black series and star wars reviews and content hope you're having a good day or night whenever you're watching this uh, may the force be with you thank you